actually what I've learned is that uh, having many sexual partner puts one at risk of contracting HIV AIDS and actually it's good to stick to one sexual partner and if at all there are doubts it is good to test with your partner before having what? Sex. Condom companies, they have always been supplying their things but uh, they have not yet been introducing such kind of education to make sure that uh, people kind of uh, abstain or to or what they want with way emphasizing on is just the use of the condoms. So. Indeed, before we before we go to the needs, we use it to to, to catch malaria and go to a risk center to get to get treatment. But now, as the mosquito gets in contact, even before it tries to enter. Dice. They have to teach us how to space yes. our children, child dispersing actually, it's about child dispersing. project launched in October 2005 as a five-year health marketing initiative in order to empower Ugandans to improve their health and lead the good life. Funded by USAID and in cooperation with the Ministry of Health, Afford set out to improve affordability, availability and accessibility of health services and products within its four intervention areas HIV AIDS, malaria, family planning and child health. Afford set out to make health products and services available, accessible and above all affordable for Ugandans and um, you don't put out the products there just like that. Um, what you do is you also need to educate the people about it and so it came with a platform of innovative communication that one um, teaches the people about what it is that you are putting out there it helps providers understand the products that they are giving out to the patients and generally build the necessary social support to use these products and services that we have put out there at the doorsteps of Ugandans. Through the Good Life platform Afford has applied innovative approaches and creative communication techniques to create demand for health services and products in Uganda. Through its promotional campaigns at all levels including mass media, provider training and consumer sensitization, Afford has improved accessibility, availability and affordability of products and services within the private sector. The afford has really helped us to, to, to reach out and, and be able to interface with the private sector more meaningfully in the health service delivery. By promoting healthy lifestyles and behaviors, Afford has empowered communities throughout Uganda to follow simple practical steps to improve their health. There's lots of traditional ways of delivering health services and delivering messages and you know you do it through clinics and you do it through communities and you do it through the radio but Afford has really um, through their communications and their entertainment as well as the educational piece have really have it's just it's kind of out there, it's very orange, you know, and it, it's um, bright and it's evident and it's apparent. And I think what keeps it fresh is that they, they keep evolving. They don't have the same message that they keep repeating over and over. Six partner organizations 
all of which have expertise in their field, came together to carry out the afford deliverables and successfully gave birth to an indigenous organization, Uganda Health Marketing Group, UHMG. Uganda is a hugely diverse country and clear market segmentation is key to successful implementation of programs, whether it is for behavioral change communication campaigns or product marketing campaigns. The immensely successful, award-winning Good Life Game Show, a multi-channel campaign, has reached an estimated 9 million Ugandans through road shows and mass media. Mixing entertainment with a health education, it was a highly interactive campaign that demonstrated to Ugandans how following simple, convenient, everyday things could help one lead the good life. Remember, you have to think. From the Good Life show, a new format evolved to communicate health messages to large crowds in a more personal and interactive manner. The four tent module. One way of attracting people to be able to take caution or to be cautious about their health is to bring it in an enjoyable and entertaining way. And that allows people to now start thinking more critically about their health. At the same time, they are enjoying what they are doing. So when you're enjoying something, you always remember. Integrating entertainment with health education, the four tent module marked a community based approach that walks crowds through tents in which they learn from experts about HIV AIDS, malaria, family planning, and child health matters and products. Your side dish could be someone else's side dish or spouse. Get off the sexual network and live a good life. The recently launched award-winning Get Off the Sexual Network one Love campaign perfectly combines traditional and modern communication methods to reduce the spread of HIV among married and long-term cohabiting couples where the incidence of new transmissions is as high as 46%. Okay, I got to learn a lot from it because I didn't know that the network would spread very fast when you don't take care of yourself. This campaign has aroused a lot of interest among the Ugandan population as it has touched the core of the problem of HIV AIDS in Uganda. It's the first campaign since the, the drum that has really got the whole country talking. I mean, we have, we've coined up, I mean, we've just made famous a few terms like side dish, sexual network, the network. Um, I mean, it's become everywhere you go, everyone is talking about it. I mean, it might, um, you might say it's much bigger than the elections at the moment. A unique achievement has been the introduction of nine new need-based products within a span of three years across the four intervention areas. Working in partnership with the private sector healthcare products and services distributors, wholesalers and retailers, Afford identified gaps that lead to constant delays in supplies and availability and launched new initiatives to increase access and affordability. A key response for improving access and affordability was setting up the UHMG product facility, a procurement and supply system with the capacity to link a database of qualified suppliers to a customer base with requirements for health products. This product facility is the hub of UHMG's product procurement and supplies. Through this initiative, the private sector distribution chain, right down to small-scale entrepreneurs in the communities, have benefited by gaining access to timely supplies, thus ensuring that the end consumer has access to affordable and quality health care. To further strengthen the private sector and improve the quality of health care services in Uganda, Afford has launched the network of Good Life Clinics through technical support, trainings and product provision, member clinics are assisted and essential drugs are made available at affordable prices. To ensure that nets would continue to be available to all Ugandans, 
Afford focused on supporting commercial suppliers through subsidies and training private health practitioners on the new anti-malaria drug policy. Furthermore, drug shop owners have been attracted to form associations to further strengthen the private sector. Initiatives such as the National Insecticide Treated Materials Association and the Association of Drug Shop Owners provide independent players and small-scale entrepreneurs with a platform from which to network and lobby policy makers. By taking health messages directly to the communities, sustainable behavior change is aimed at without the continued involvement of a Ford. We went to the people, so we met them at wet places, we met them out of the mango tree, we met them at lorry parks, we met them in the community, we met them outside hospitals, we met them on football uh, parks. We went to the people. We had face-to-face interaction with the people. About 70% of our programming talk to people one-on-one. -on -one. Afford set out to involve popular opinion leaders, POLs, individuals who are influential, respected and well-known in their communities. Afford provided these POLs with training on health issues across all four intervention areas empowering them to initiate community dialogue and increase the demand for quality health care. Nari gave me to my mom Gwangi, Gwakuwa Bula, Banange, Okupa to Sakula Mowe Yagaza. Their major role has been community sensitization on health issues leading to behavior change and demand creation for UHMG products as well as referring community members to good life clinics. Another initiative has been the Hero Couple campaign that was launched based on research showing that the highest rate of HIV transmission is amongst married couples. 22 master couples from throughout the regions were identified and trained by Afford, empowering them to inspire and educate other couples back in their communities. Telling them how to be happy in their family how to stay as one body as a family and also how to be careful with the, the HIV AIDS which is now the percentage is very high among the married couples. Leading by example, hero couples are now hosting weekly meetings in their communities gathering other couples to discuss issues related to sexual health. First they didn't like it so much like the words we are used were a bit of sin, but later they come to re they came to realize it was a good thing. What has made Afford so unique is its innovative approaches and creative communication techniques in diverse contexts to create demand for health services and products in Uganda, as well as the lasting effect we hope it will have. We will continue to improve access and availability as well as affordability of basic healthcare products to Ugandans throughout the country. We will also work closely hand in hand with the Ministry of Health to develop simple and practical messages uh, through innovative marketing techniques and communication techniques to deliver these health messages to the communities so that uh, Ugandans can live a good life. The successful launch of Uganda Health Marketing Group, UHMG, the promising and potential offspring of Afford, will continue Afford's journey to ensure a Uganda where families and communities are empowered to improve their health through availability of a wide range of sustainable health products and services. 
it was a unique mentoring process that through implementation of AFFORD, we were building our own strength. And so, even when we, the launching of the UHMG came, it was a seamless transition because we were already empowered with the skills and knowledge to continue with what AFFORD was doing. Um, UHMG will um, stand out tall as an organization of integrity, um, good programming, um, and um, a passion to help Ugandans um, in their quest for a good health. UHMG is on its way to becoming a self-sustaining, self-reliant institution that is committed to bringing good life to Ugandans.